another day, another summer banner, or so it seems, considering this is the third FGO one in the last week and a half that I've been rolling for. So, thanks, FGO. Um, this time for Merlin, as you can see, he was the one that I wanted the most from the guaranteed SSRs, which you can probably tell given that I had him in the thumbnail and title for both of those. Didn't come home, as expected, he's, uh, always spiting me. I expect him to continue spiting me today, considering that I've had some pretty good luck uh, in the last couple FGO banners, but we will see. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, Merlin, Target, and the 5 star uh, Craft Essence I still don't have. Um, so we'll just see. Uh, I might just cut it off at some point because I don't want to... I'm not going to go crazy with him like I would for Musashi or uh, Melt Okita, but... Let's just uh, hop right in. <clears throat> I'll skip all of the uh, non four and five star stuff as always. I, oh my god. The entire last video, all I did was say how annoyed I am that I keep seeing that CE. Wow, a servant on the first one. Berserker, huh? I thought I skipped. Wow, oh, that, uh, that was a blue balls right there if I've ever seen one. Anyway, I'm sick of seeing the 4-star C. I don't want to see it ever again, and I keep seeing it. It's, uh, really... <laughs> I don't know why I just keep getting that one C. But, whatever. Um, okay. There we go, finally got the 5 star one. Nice. And if that was a full attack CE, that, I mean a full attack stat, that would be a really nice effect for uh, the main DPS. God, stop. Oh, another five star. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Um, would be nice if we could get a servant, but we will see, I guess. There we go, servant. I'd love to see a caster background and not saber. Ah, Siegfried. It pains me. Pretty sure I already have Siegfried uh, MP5, so... Uh, this one will make a very nice... Rare Prism. Oh. A lot of CEs in this roll. Damn. One, two, three, four, five, five. Four star and up CEs. Three of the three star event CE. That was a very, very solid roll in terms of. Uh, not worthless stuff. Five star again? Wow. Damn. 
This is not going great. But as I said, Merlin, uh, very fitting given his personality and everything, but he just seems to, this is a servant, seems to spite me every time I try getting him. Lance, what? Come on. I think I only had one of her though, so probably NP2, which that's fine, but I don't think she even has a damage NP, so it really doesn't matter. Whatever. Ugh! I guess I shouldn't get that upset about that 4-star CE because, oh my god, as I'm saying, I shouldn't get upset about it. It'll make good uh, fodder for my CE bombs because this Heavenly Demon Princess CE in this event is pretty good, so I'd like to level that, and uh, oh my god, I think I just uh, MLB'd Black Grail. Really? Oh my god. I am so fucking sick of that card. I was saying, I think I just MLB'd Black Grail within the last month or so. So that would be nice to level up because it's very good for Castoria looping. So. Fuck that CE. Man. Alright, only have three more shots. Another five star. Okay. Another five star. I think I'm one away from. Actually, I might have enough to MLB it. So I think I've gotten three before that. Alright, uh, I'm gonna bust out the good luck charm. Which, if I haven't said before, <clears throat> is the uh, absolute demonic front Babylonia. OST track from the Babylonia anime that came out uh, about a year and a half ago. So it doesn't always work, but I'll try. See if I can't get anything lucky. Uh, so how it's a good luck charm is that I just play it in the background and then I hit summon uh, the exact moment that the song drops. So, I'm gonna just skip to shortly before the drop, and then hit the summon as soon as it drops. Caster, please. No! <laughs> no! That was heartbreaking. I really thought that it was going to work for a second there. Uh, why... All right, this is it. Merlin, please. I need Buster crit memes. I did say that he would probably spite me, and uh, he spited me for the third time. Really annoying.
but I don't actually need him. It's a nice to have, not a need to have, so I'm going to try and be responsible and just cut it off there and not roll any more, because that would mean buying more. And I have other things I would like to spend my money on. So, yeah, that's uh, unfortunate, but that's just how the gacha goes sometimes. At least he's not a must-have for me like Musashi was. Or... And I think it's actually super quiet for banners in general uh, from now on. I don't, I don't really care about anything else this year aside from uh, Space Ishtar, who I will, like uh, Musashi, be trying to go for MP24 right from the start, so... I don't think I'll really be rolling anything until then, so I can build up hopefully a sizable amount of quartz to have for that. So that'll uh, be interesting to see what happens. But as always, uh, you know, let me know. Did you roll on the Merlin banner? Did you get him or not? Uh, if not, we can be depressed about it together. Uh, if you didn't roll for it, then, you know, what banner are you waiting for? I imagine a lot of people are waiting for, suspicious, uh, for Space Ishtar like I am, or something else. I know next year has a lot of good stuff, um, aside from even just Castoria. There's recurring, uh, returning banners for popular servants, new servants, so some good stuff coming up next year. So, yeah, let me know what you'll be doing, and uh, as always, thanks for watching my video, and until next time.